Hi guys, uh, welcome back to the channel. Uh, well, in this video, we are going to see how to do the object tracking using a turtle boat and the OpenCV2 and ROS2. So, well, uh, we'll go through the script uh, which is going to track the object and we'll go in, it's going to give the coordinates of the object x, y. So, well, uh, in this video, you will understand how to do the object tracking and object deduction using a CV2 and what are the essential libraries you are going to use to do those uh, scripting process. So after this you will understand how to do the object following and line segmentation or line following. So these things you will understand from this uh, tutorial. So I already wrote a blog on this uh, coordinates or a TF. So TF between the camera to the object uh, how the coordinates will be changed and uh, these things I wrote on blog in medium I will give those blog uh, link in my description you can follow that and you will get idea. So like. Uh, TF data transformation between the camera to the object. So the well the object is moving, the TF value also change and the post estimation like that. So the arco marker directions, those things you will uh, get from that medium block and also you can implement the same process in the which is going on this uh, video. So we'll start with a video and uh, open terminal already launched this uh, turtle board three uh, simulation part. So we will uh, open a we will open a CV, so this is a directory I uh, created for this uh, process, so here the package I created, so we need to create a package, so the I am created a package name like an object underscore tracking, so inside object tracking we need to go, so here we need to use this so turtle bot underscore track and dot pi, so get ready turtle bot underscore track and dot pi. So well uh, this script is going to do the object tracking and uh, coordinates. So well uh, you can get the idea first we need to import this uh, rcpy. So this rcpy is a library for uh, python script for ROS2. So then uh, we import the message type. So then after this is our message type. So cv bridge is to convert the ROS image to the open cv. Uh, to it's like an API to convert between the one another. So the CV we imported and NumPy for uh, numerical uh, mathematical uh, operations. So then after uh, uh, we give the <coughs> publisher and subscriber thing. So here the publisher node is an object underscore coordinates is a uh, topic and it's going to subscribe to the camera slash image raw. So the camera slash image raw is a topic of Tenderbot 3. So for more understanding, we'll open a new terminal and uh, type ROS2 topic list. Okay. After typing ROS topic list, you can find out that uh, we'll get a. We need to play the simulation. So it's already simulated. So once again, we update. Yeah. So here you can find out that the camera slash image underscore raw. So this is a topic which is subscribed with this uh, script. So this script is going to get the image data from the turtle board using this topic of uh, publisher topic of turtle board to the subscriber topic of this script for the image tra uh, object track. So then the topic name for this publisher node is object underscore tracking. So if you are going to use uh, uh, CMD well uh, command for controlling your uh, robot base right so you can subscribe this object tracking to the uh, object following thing node so the object segmentation and object uh, coordinate will be take over by this node and your uh, object following is take over by the another node with the publishing topic of this thing so the cmd well is going to subscribe with the object following and it is also subscribed with the work so we can do like that so request and response the service thing. So then now, uh, then we can come here like this is a part for giving the coordinates of your objects. So when tracking the object or uh, pressing the object, it will be uh, give the x y coordinates. Like right? so, this is the coordinates, the point. So then after the image is converted to the CV bridge and it will publishing the image uh, in the raw spot the frame port so then now uh, say right so we'll launch the code now so we'll save this so after saving now uh, we need to source the terminal 
open C source install set dot dash. Right. So now we launch ROS2 run object tracking then turtle board right turtle board underscore tracker. So now we we'll launch this. So wait a minute or it will launch. So now now we go to this terminal and type ROS2 topic. Topic list. So we'll enter it. So now you can see that uh, we'll get the topic of object coordinates, object tracking underscore image. So these are the topics we get, right? So now we'll launch uh, RQT to visualize the nodes, how it's connecting, and how the data is transferred between one another node. So now we'll launch the RQT. We'll wait for some time. So we'll close this and uh, go to the plugins introspection and the node graph so well you can see that so the node yeah you can see that the camera driver is sharing the image to the coordinates of uh, object tracking thing so the publisher thing is this the topic and using an image raw topic to the image coordinates part right yeah you can see that image underscore uh, raw the object tracking thing so well uh, now we use this uh, RQT to visualize the thing. So go to the the Zibu and go to the insert and we we'll import some boxes to the cradle board. So then go to this RQT and uh, make a full screen. And here go to the plugins uh, visualization image bit. So you can see that now the object is tracking by the robot by the turtle so go to the another terminal and uh, we'll launch the tele operation thing ROS2 uh, run leo just keyboard Now enter it and we'll wait for some time and we'll operate the turtle and you can now uh, visualize the things so that coordinates is taken over by the robot. So we come in back side. So you can see that object is tracked by the robot. So now you can see that object is tracking, right? So the XY coordinates also take over by this uh, tracking object. So then, uh, we'll launch the RVs and uh, we'll see the, how the visualization is going. Yeah, we'll start it. Now you go to the QD and you can see that the tracking thing is going on, right? So now we we'll close this uh, RQT and uh, we we'll launch the RVs. RVs too. And uh, in RVs, uh, you can uh, see that the output of the image thing. So image is track and the coordinates will be given by the node which we created. So after this tutorial, you will understand how to do these things with your uh, real world robot also you can implement this and you can do the object following and uh, line following things using this so you can see in uh, RQD uh, always the box is detected uh, by the tracking coordinates node right so then uh, you can implement uh, now we try to implement this uh, node uh, sorry uh, which I wrote the blog on uh, camera and uh, thing 
So otherwise, uh, you can follow that uh, tutorial or a Medium blog to implement uh, implement those things in the simulation. The real world also the coordinate frame to pick and place the objects or uh, to uh, follow the object or uh, to do the recharging work, uh, the battery recharging using our co-marker deduction or apparel tag to localize the landmark localization approach. So thank you. We'll see in next video how to do the line following and how to do the object following thing using OpenCV2. Thank you. We'll see you next video.